Hello guys and welcome back to the channel today. I'm going to be doing a video of the um, Free Trade app UK, which is uh, basically like the UK's version of Robinhood, if you want to say. I've been I've been using this app for around six months now, ever since I first got into the investing game. I tried a couple of other ones, but they wasn't really, they were a bit too complicated sort of thing for me, but I found Free Trade and it was really simple to use and I understood it pretty much straight away. So I'll be, just go, I'll be going over just give you a little tutorial as well of the app. So I'll log into my free trade account now. And you can see on the first the first uh, tab at the bottom left you have is your portfolio. This is where obviously it'll show all your investments, what you've got, and it puts them in the order of how much money you've got in each company. Also you can see there in the middle of your screen is the graph can see uh, the performance of the last day, last seven days, last month, and then overall. I would like free trade, well I think they are doing, I think it is in the planning. I would like them to put in, um, a, like they do on the Robinhood app, you can see, you can like drag it and see how much you've invested of your own money compared to how much is in your portfolio. So you get a better understanding of how much um, you've actually made on the on on your investments so far. I, I have to, work it out myself which isn't 100 percent accurate i don't think but hey ho until free trade do that this is how it is the next tab we have is the discover tab so this is where the magic happens you can view view all your stocks bonds ets what you want to buy so you can filter it down if you want to just look at uk stocks click on the uk uh, tab and it'll bring up all the different companies and uh, etfs and bonds in the UK section same with America again you can just untick it when you don't want it stock ETFs so there's all the different ETFs that free trade have so you can untick that and then we can go on to the bonds if you want to invest in some bonds here's all the different um, bonds that they have on that section and finally you can just filter it down to stocks only uh, it's a quite new uh, thing for free trade, um, which is I do. I've it does make it easier, especially if you want to diversify. Another good way for diver diversifying is um, they have it filtered by sector. So there you can see, guys, you've got tech, finance, industrials, food, drink, consumer goods, your entertainment, energy, health. There's all sorts of different ones, guys, which really, really does help with your diversification. And then they also have a section on popular ETFs, which is good so you know which ones people are buying. Again, they'll have the same with the, with the stocks also. You know, tech Titans there, another, another section which they have. So you've got the likes of Facebook, Intel, Apple. Um, sorry, if you can hear any noise in the background, guys, I am outside doing this video, so I just hope it doesn't come out too loud. And then... The final uh, section they have is they have all, so that shows every single thing on the free trade app. The next tab we have is the activity tab. This shows where all your where you place all your orders. It shows what you've purchased and what you've sold. The one thing I do wish they could improve on is um, I know this again is in planning with free trade. It should probably be here within a few months, maybe. I'm not too sure. But if they could show your dividends on on screen, that would be that would be really helpful because at the moment they do message you in an individual chat to tell you you've received a dividend. But I think it would be much easier if it said on this activity tab what company you received the dividend and dividend from and how much money. So I know that's that is in the working. So you can see when you've topped up and all this all this whole. Um, you st monthly statements as well which is good so yeah so there's a couple of things on that which they could improve but I know free trade are working on it so that's really good and then next we have is your account so this basically shows how much you've got available to invest withdrawable cash unsettled cash reserved cash and then there's the top up tab so 
yeah that's it that is it for my um free trade review video guys Over, overall i do think it is a really really good app to use especially if you're a beginner i i enjoy using this uh, app very much and even when robin hood does come to the uk i will still be using free trade no doubt about that i would probably give this app a four and a half four maybe four four and a half out of five obviously there's a few things that i wish they could improve on uh the dividend how you see the dividends um I wish it was in the activity tab, which I know is coming. Also, the graph, which I mentioned, so you know how much money you've actually invested into your portfolio compared to um, how much it actually currently stands at. And also, I wish this... Um, there's another, another thing I wish, um, that they could have um, a direct... Because at the moment, you've got to wait two to four hours for your, when you deposit money for it to come into your free trade account. But it's, it's just little things, guys. But overall, the app's really good. It's really easy to use. And I, I really enjoy it. So that's, that's it for today's video, guys. So if you could uh, like this video, please, and subscribe to my channel, I would really appreciate that. I know, uh, and thanks for all the kind comments and all my other videos. I really appreciate it. Anyway, guys, enjoy the rest of your days. Bye.